the Mila 6880 30-inch touch oven. Like the oven very much when it works. We've just been having a lot of intermittent problems with it, and the oven glass just shattered on my wife when she was cooking in it. We just did a major remodel uh, to my house. Uh, I put over $100,000 into uh, remodeling my kitchen. My wife is a part-time chef, so she's a master cook. I'm amazed that I'm not 300 pounds, but um, she's amazing. And she designed the kitchen, and when she showed me the oven that she wanted, I didn't want to get it because I thought it was overpriced. She was, meal is the best. Get meal out. I'm telling you, this is the oven. Okay. Got the oven. She loved it. No problems. And then after about a year in, we started having some issues where condensation would build up in a display panel and the oven, it would keep the heat, but the, the LED display kept flickering and we couldn't do anything. I had to go outside and power it off. Fine. Okay. One little glitch. No problem. Then the other day, my wife was cooking for a, uh, an event that her and another chef were doing. She has a lot of other chefs come and cook over at our kitchen because we have so much room and they love her stove and they love her oven. And then she heard a pop. She heated the oven to about 395, 400, not even all that hot and opened the door. And I have a picture here. I don't know how to show it to you. On um, If you open up the oven door and look on the inside, there's a surface of glass there shattered completely. So I called Mila. And I said, oh, it's not under warranty. I'm like, but the thing's less than two years. It's only two years old. Well, we don't warranty the glass. And now I got to pay. I paid $6,000 for this oven. $6,000. I could have bought two or three Thermador ovens. But um, this is what she wanted. So now I'm going to have to pay about three fifty, four hundred dollars dollars uh, to have the oven repaired. So I'm not, I'm not thrilled. Um, you know, I... I I looked at the installation instructions. I downloaded them off the internet. It was installed by my professional contractor exactly as they specified. And um, so here I am. Uh, she likes Mila because their supposed reputation for quality and being well built. When the oven works, she loves it. Loves it. Um, the problem is we've had two issues with it already, and the thing's not even three years old. Uh, so I'm, I'm a bit concerned now. Um, you know, first we had the display flashing on and off, reset powers, didn't fix it. And now I have this problem. I don't know what else I'm going to have with this oven uh, to replace it's out of the question. So I'm just going to have to keep getting it fixed. I posted the review because I, I was a pissed off consumer. Um, you know, I spent top dollar to get a top-notch product, and I don't feel that I got that. And then just to tell me that we're not going to warranty and I have to pay out of pocket for these repairs, uh, I just don't think it's acceptable when you pay $6,000 for a single, not a dual, a single wall of it. That's a lot of money. I would like them to, number one, fix my glass, my shattered glass in my oven for free. That's one. The second thing is I would like clarification on the installation of their uh, product because I looked in the installation manual. Uh, they had a technician come here uh, for the flashing on the display and tell me that the unit's not vented properly. So I showed him the diagram. I said, Look, here's your installation diagram. We followed it to the letter. Well, you got to drill holes in your cabinets to let the heat vent out. I'm like, Okay, well, well show me where it says that in the installation instruction. It doesn't. So I would like clarification on that as well. And if holes need to be drilled, show me how to do it, why I'm doing it, and give me some specifications on how many and how big.